As a Jewish majority, it's very easy to talk about um, Israel being uh, protecting minorities' rights and all those ki all kind of things like that. But it's another kind of perspective to actually listen to minorities from Israel speak about it themselves or their own experiences. Hi, guys. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Herman Serafian. I'm the president here at SSI UCLA. Uh, first of all, I want to thank Reservists on Duty for coming here today for this rare opportunity. Also, I want to thank the Jewish National Fund. I will also I want to thank the Jewish National Fund, the Zionists of America, and the Nazarian Center for um, helping us sponsor this today. Um, so the, the way the program is going to work, uh, the Reservists on Duty is going to have their presentation. At the end, we're going to save, we're going to have a Q&A, so please save your questions until the end. Um, please keep noise down during the uh, event and turn your cell phones on vibrate or silent if you can. And now I'm going to introduce our panelists. First of all, I'm going to introduce Mohammed Kabia. Mohammed is a Muslim Israeli Bedouin and former IDF soldier. Today, he works as a cons strategic consultant for the IDF, specializing in Bedouin and foreign affairs. Next, I want to introduce Ram Assad, a Jewish Israeli former combat soldier. He was raised in Isfia. His father was the founder of the Drew Sons Trail Race in memory of the IDF Drew's fallen soldiers. Next, we have Dema Taya. Dema is an Arab Israeli Muslim. She was born and raised in Kalansawe. She believes that real coexistence derives from recognition of one another and working together. Finally, we have Jonathan Nazar El Khoury. El Khoury. Israeli, he's, um, Jonathan is an Israeli Lebanese Christian. Uh, he's the minorities coordinator for the res NGO Reserves and Duty in Israel. And without further ado, I'd like to introduce Jonathan to come. Thank you very much, uh, Hemret, and uh, for uh, all the partners that participated in co-hosting this event. Uh, we really appreciate uh, your presence here and your help uh, to to give us the platform to share our stories uh, with you. So I'm going to start uh, to talk a bit <laughs> about Reservist on Duty. Uh, Reservist on Duty was established in 2015 by uh, combat soldiers and uh, former combat soldiers and uh, reservists in the IDF uh, that saw that their name is being used in many organizations in order to uh, attack Israel or in order to say that they did uh, some terrible things that didn't happen in reality. Um, after uh <coughs> they started uh, the organization, we saw that uh, eventually what is going on on college campuses, like this one over here, and over uh, other organizations, is that they are using the minorities that live in Israel in order to attack Israel. And the reasons for that is because... Uh, there is a lot of lack inf of information about our lives as minorities in Israel. People think that we live in an apartheid state. People think that we are being misrepresentative everywhere in the country. People think that uh, we are uh, uh, being discriminated against uh, by the government or by other officials. And that we don't have any freedom. Freedom of expression, freedom, freedom of religion. Uh, and that's the reason that we are here today, in order to show you and share with you these unique stories of Israel's minorities. We are here for minorities. Me as a Christian, uh, Dima as a Muslim woman, Ram as a Druze guy, and uh, Muhammad Kabia as a Bedouin. We are, uh, I will talk numbers later. To begin with, I want to show you a short video of what we experienced at UC Irvine. We were invited by the SSI chapter at UC Irvine uh, last May to participate in the uh, counter event of the anti-Zionism week, that's how they call it over there, and uh, to held a panel. And during this week, we experienced a lot of discrimination against us that came to uh, uh, this place. And you can see in the video, uh, Muhammad and I, because we were there together with other uh, members of the reservist on duty. So. Let's see the video. <laughs> 